You have seen that direct measurement means measurements taken over the surface of a site with a suitable measuring device. Sometimes though, if the survey has to cover many long distances, it is not convenient to use direct means of measurement. Also, some of the ground features or other objects on the site may be too large to be measured directly. In such conditions, we have to rely on indirect means of linear measurements in order to obtain correct surveying data. So, what are the indirect means of linear measurement? Let's find out the answer in this module. Welcome! After completing this module, you will be able to explain the indirect means of linear measurements.